Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. Um, so, it's almost the middle of November, or maybe by the time this is up, it's already mid-November. And everybody's um, all preparing for December daily or Christmas and all that. Um, so I thought, as I'm preparing for my December daily journal, I would um, get some ephemera organized so um as you know i'm now hooked on to making my own collage fodder or fodders um so i thought i'd create a um like christmas bubbles watercolor christmas bubbles and, and using them for my december december daily journal so i've got this um ruler stencil type thing and i'm gonna use this i think that's just about um, a good size um, circle but I'm gonna leave a, a space on like at the top so I can put the kind of like the metal bit that you hang it with kind of thing so I'm gonna draw with my pencil and I'm gonna draw 25 maybe or even 31 because I use um, I like doing my December daily until December 31 or even January the 1st. Um, you can either create 25 or, you know, or less or more. Um, hang on. Yeah, that should be enough. So I'm gonna draw all my circles and I'll come back to you. So I have taken out my Marian Bright um, Little Rainbow Moon watercolor set. This was from last year. Yes, there are doubles. So <laughs> I think I've got the other the other two from a like a bargain set, but I thought I'd just put them all together. So. Um, you have in this color set um, purple punch um, Mary Berry what's this green mistletoe and royal gold so I think I'll use this they're kind of like a pink purpley um, set so what I want to do is try on wet on wet on wet technique so I'm just gonna wake up my watercolors by putting some water in them these are like very shimmery um, watercolor set um, there's no matte to it or no mat on the set I think they're all shimmery from what I remember right so I want to do this green first and I just want to play with colors to be honest so I'm gonna go green and purple and let's see how that what happens and how that works I'm gonna play around and then I'm gonna go for pink or this Mary Berry with purple because I think that would be beautiful I don't mind it going outside the lines or the circles that I've created simply because I know that I will I've got to run them so that's fine that's not gonna be the end of the world okay so that's quite pretty isn't it let's see if I go for purple oh I've done a dry on so I'm just gonna put a 
wet on dry situation here and then probably drop in this pink and see what happens so I'm just literally playing here oh don't know about that Oh, I like key. So I just let the watercolors play. screen just let it all like let all the um, watercolor do their magic Good. Go. oh goodness me I keep forgetting I need to wet my circles first before I do anything. Okay. That's that. And what the You can probably see that I'm just playing here. So what I'll do is um Carry on painting my um, my circles, dry it, and then I'll come back and see and um, show you what I'm gonna do next. Okay, all right. So I have painted them all and dried them all. I've used some of the watercolors from the new Little Rainbow Moon um, Merry Magical Winter watercolor set. Um, just to kind of like have a bit of a variety because I've kind of like run out of color in the end so I know there's a lot of um, um, circles anyway so how I plan to do this is obviously I have my Unibull eye and I have this um, metallic craftwork pen I had for donkey's ears <laughs> donkey's ears I had for a while and a white gel pen so in my head is that what I want to do is obviously outline the circle goodness outline the circle and then I'm going to use my metallic um, craft work pen to put the you know that little metal thing on the top like so And then I'll just wait for that to dry. Hopefully, once I'm waiting for that to dry, I will obviously put some decorations or dots. Or doodles. I'm going to do that 
and do the that. So then I will do that on all of the circles and I shall be back. I wonder whether if I use this I could make a better circle. I'm not sure now. Um, just to use it as a guide and it's like a yeah I would I'll probably use this and just to kind of like highlight the edge that way Let's do that again. So I'll probably just have a little look where the circles that the circles that I made. Yeah. Um, there it is. Why didn't I think of this before? do that so I'm gonna do that on all of my circles okay so I'm just gonna do like five and I'll do what I've done a while ago like before so I'm gonna put that um, gold thing on top or like you know the metal bit at the top of it So then, I think there's something missing in this one, so I'll just put some, like... Like that, a scallop. And then I'll just do that. Scallop. And then line. And one more time. Okay. So what you need to do now is to cut this.
Bobo's ephemera. Um, obviously, I'm not going to cut out all of these um, <laughs> in front of you, but that's how um, I've envisioned them. So I've got my white. You can use Bosca pen, paint pens. I think I'm struggling because of the metallic paints, but I'll probably use um, a Bosca paint pen on some of them. So, so draw a circle, do a wet on wet technique. Doesn't matter if the watercolor goes out of the line. Then you draw, then you kind of like highlight and draw the circle with a paint, with a pen. And then use a metallic paint pen or metallic pen to um, put that metal bit on the top of the bubble and draw the um the details with your this black pen unibol eye um use your white gel pen to kind of like do some doodles do some designs and then cut them out and they look like this you can make it bigger or smaller if you want um i think this is just about right so this will be my you know on my page my number so i'll put numbers in them and I, you'll see, you'll see me use this in my December daily um, journaling. I hope you like it, guys. What I've shared, um, and I hope this inspires you to create your own kind of like number, the number days for your December daily or ephemera for your December daily. I'll um, do another Christmassy ephemera type thing again so stay tuned and hope you have a great day and thanks for watching don't forget to like and subscribe see you later guys bye